how to wash my hands before I eat. Right. I can't tell Dragon it to dirt. psychology department equipment, uh, a lot of very expensive equipment. In fact, haven't you already entered into an agreement with Stephen Rimbauer, the last oh, remaining family member? Good afternoon, oh, Mr. Bobby. Bobby. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Well, Joyce, we have to discuss this. I think not. Well, you're going to have to discuss it sooner or later. Speaking for the department, I think I can say our patience with your shenanigans has grown oh, quite shame short. that David Duke died during this movie. Oh, well. 
cow's bells. Later, YouTubers. Out there in that lovely land. I'm glad I don't have a lot of subscribers, and I'm glad that people don't watch my shit. Mm. I
1950 was the year Ellen Rimbauer was Ah, that's funny. We'll the trouble with Rose Red started even before there was a house. Construction crews work 24 hours a day, seven days a week. But that was the problem. The problem was that even before there was a house there, that piece of ground is making me mad. I mean, literally mad. The teamster made no effort to get away. Just dropped the gun on the seat of his wagon and went down the street to a Seattle saloon. This is where the police found him. His name was Harry Corbin. When he was tried, he claimed he remembered nothing from breakfast that morning till the time when he woke up in a jail cell with a knot behind his ear. The judge didn't believe him, and neither did the jury. He got 25 years. I think Harry Corbin may have been Rose Red's first victim. No, I don't want to do First male victim. There has always been a difference between the way Rose Red treats the ladies and the gentlemen. What do you mean, uh, exactly? All in good time, Nick. Nick. All in good time. John Rimbauer and Ellen Gilchrist were married on November 12, 1907. He was 40. She was 20. By the day they said their I do, Rose Red had been under construction for a year. Man. And already, there had been three deaths. In addition, the murder of Rimbauer's first foreman.